everyone, welcome back to Factions. So, let's go in the water. Oh, that looks way more dramatic, doesn't it? So, there was so much support on the first episode that I decided that I will do another episode this week to show how much I do enjoy Factions and want to bring it out. So, unfortunately, I had just sold all of the beef that was in the chest. We don't have a lot of money in the here. But, I have been buying things really cheap, because that's how I make my money. So we have an Enderman Spawner, which I bought for, I think it was 60k. And they sell at about 80 to 100k, depending on who's on. I also bought two more Cow Spawners and Cave Spawners, and I still have that. So we are going to sell these right now. So these, I believe, so if you go into slash AH comes up with the auction house. Let's see if there's any in here. Nope. Oh, the other thing I bought was a blaze spawner, which I got really cheap. I bought this blaze spawner for 330k, which you know, you're like, whoa, that's a lot of money. But no, on the server they sell for about, as you saw, 350 to 370k. So it does depend on who's on, who's willing to buy. But most of the time they sell for anywhere between that price. So what we're going to do is we're going to sell these cave spider spawners for 16 K basically each because that's really the average that case buyers go on for because they're actually quite popular this we're going to do we're going to salvage these iron tools now the way you get these is in the slash kit starter which is this one which I have just done um, to get it all because I, um, I use my alt account to also get the same thing so you know I can basically double but you know it's it's not that bad so we'll go and see how much of the stuff I have. I'm pretty sure I have more in the other chests. Oh, this one's a bit full. Uh, let's take all this out. Um, got the hiccups. Just ate, just ate a beautiful sandwich. Um, <laughs> okay, so we'll put all these in. Uh, we won't take those. We'll take all these. So you don't really need the iron tools. Also, look, okay, I told you I had quite a few of them. So to salvage, you need a gold block. And you just right click it and it gives you an iron per uh, tool or per iron anything so even excuse me even this chest plate will give you one and so are these boots so all the items basically give you one even if it takes more but because you get them for free it's really not that bad it doesn't look like anyone wants to buy them for 16k, so I might lower the price after I've done this uh, to maybe 15 50 Actually, I'll just do it now. So, because I have a rank, I can put two on at a time. Uh, sometimes they sell for 16k, and like I said, just depend on who's on, who's buying. So we'll go ahead and sell 15 and do that one as well. Double check that I did the right pricing. Yep, okay, good. Hopefully someone will buy it. If not, oh well. So we'll keep on doing all this. I think the envoy has just happened, unfortunately. Again, missing out. Right, so we've all... Oh, there we go. See, so first one sold here. Oh, it's a Death Note 3000. He bought it. So now we'll do the other ones that we have to sell. So we'll do the cow spawner next. So these usually sell for 50k each, but I like to reel people in. We're doing it 1k cheaper because people think they're getting a better deal. Um, so I, so that's what I do. I don't have to do that, but that's what I do. So yeah. So now we'll go and carry on with all this iron stuff. Do, 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 do. Uh, we'll leave some of the stuff just in case I want to do some PvP later. It will take all this because when I PvP, I use starter gear because I don't really, I don't want to lose all the other gear. To be honest, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, moving my mic. Right. Okay, here we go. And let's take some of those. See, this is like my PvP stuff <laughs> that I use because I don't want to, you know, use things that, you know, are valuable in a way. I sense, I suppose. So now we'll quickly. Sell all of these. Sell all these? Salvage these is what I was meant to say. And boop, 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 And now we just keep on doing this repetitively until I just finish. Which I think this will be all that I will do. Oh, I've almost got a full set of armor on, apparently. 
not what I was aiming to do, and this is ridiculously loud. But you probably heard that through the mic because it all actually goes through my TV and not my headset. Because I've noticed when it goes through my headset, it doesn't always work. So yeah, so now, oh, so I forgot about these. We'll put these down here because it's annoying that you can't shift click them. And boom, boom. Alright, so now we just do slash sell hand. Let's see how much we get. So that was $2,800. Go slash bell. Now we're up to a million again. So really, if we add these together, that is 1.3, 1 1.4, 1 uh, two, four. That's oh, oh, and there goes the other ones. One just sold here, which is pretty good. And so that's basically 1.5, 1.6 mil at the moment, which isn't too bad. So now if we go slash bell, now we're at 1.1. Go back into our PV and let's get the troll -a -lol -a -lol. and let's sell some dust. Hmm, which one shall we sell? Okay, we'll sell the four one just so I can show you, and then we'll open these. So we'll sell the troll -a -lol -a -lol for H, sell 19k, and then you were four, yep, AH sell 4k. So now we double check to make sure I put them in at the right price. What was the other thing I put in? Oh yeah, this. Right, and now we've got the simple cosmic chest. So these come in the slash kit starter. So let's quickly open these. Boom, 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 boom. Just do random, just click anywhere. See what we get if we are feeling lucky today. I hope you're all feeling lucky. Simple book, simple book. Diamond chest plate and simple book. Okay, three simple books. Right, let's open another one. And let's go boom, 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 boom. Okay, let's see what we get. Hopefully we get something better. I hope. I don't actually know what the best thing you can get is, but simple book, emerald, that's not too bad. Shovel and an axe, okay. Right, so we can slash sell hand that. Put all this up there. And now we'll open the books one at a time. So one, two, three, huh! No, they didn't do really well. I need to Need to do something. Uh, maybe in this corner is my lucky corner. Nope, that's that's not, mate, this cake. It's gotta be this cake. This cake's gotta be lucky. Oh, that's not too bad. It's alright. It's alright. And okay, so <laughs> really only good thing we got was haste two. That was actually a really good percent as well. Now we'll go slash tinkerer. Boom, boom, boom. Make sure. Yep, and click. And now open. Oh. First one is a lucky charm, apparently. Oh, and oh wow, that's actually impressive. Usually I fail miserably at that. Let's see which ones we got. Two percent and one percent, not too bad. Let's see if we still got everything in there. Yep. Okay, hoppers for sale. I have the hiccups. Oh, I hate having hiccups. Okay, so we'll put these back in our PV. Hopefully, the other stuff will sell soon. Uh, let's put all this away. Boom, boom. Keep you out. Let's grab some food. And there we are. Right. Let's go to slash spawn and see when the next on envoy. I think I'm saying that right. Envoy or envoy? I don't know. I'm pretty sure it's envoy. Um, is so. It is in seven minutes, it's roughly seven to seventeen minutes. So I go slash home again. And, whew, whew, oh yeah, I've got upstairs to do, don't I? Right, so we'll quickly run upstairs and see if there's anything, because I did an AFK overnight, because sometimes my computer likes to have a spares. So, <laughs> if it's left on for too long, so yeah, so we have nothing. So slash, little hand. But we do have all this wheat and all that to gather up, which I will do off camera. So you guys don't have to watch the exciting stuff of getting wheat. <laughs> but I'll do that after this episode, so it's okay. Right, I will basically wait till the envoy starts. So see you guys in just a few seconds. Alright, so envoy is should be starting any minute now. Chances are we are going to die as there's three people here with armor and I 
I don't have any armor on me. But what an envoy is, is basically chests come pull from the sky, um, you punch them, and anywhere from a simple to a legendary chests will fall, so obviously you can get some really good gear. Um, but it is a PvP zone, obviously, so they can kill you and destroy you and take all your love and everything that you thought was great in life. So that's pretty much what the Envoy is. It should be starting any moment now, because um, it starts anywhere between 20 to 30 minutes. Uh, so yeah, it's been about 20-something minutes now. Almost 30, so it should be starting any moment. I'm not quite sure. Uh, hi. Um, so, yeah, this could be interesting or not. Now, what's really good, um, well, not good, but easy, well, not easy, better to have is to have, I think, it's, well, like, second and the highest, the second highest and the highest rank on the server which makes you fly because then you can just fly around and get all the loot which I do not have so I will not be doing that one so yeah you are getting too close for comfort mate <laughs> so yes yeah, so that is what that was the that could be happening that is what could be happening I would go home and get armor now but I'm too scared that I'm going to miss it and I really don't want to wait another half an hour for the next one because it's, oh, I forget, and I start doing something else, and then I just forget, and I just keep on missing them, or I come back as soon as they start, and it's too late by then. Because you need to be there, like, straight, straight on the dot, you need to be there on time, like, you'll be a second late, oh, you might as well forget it, don't even bother, huh, time. So, yeah, especially with the seven second, like, teleporting, so, yay, fun, okay. Right, Whew. let's get that yawn out of the way. Let's get ready to go. Right, should be happening any moment now. I turned around for just one second and then saw all of these people. So Amazon and Bamboo and Tropico, Tro, whatever, are flying ones. So I have a feeling that um, that person's skin is very vivid. Um, a flying... Uh, you know, flying once, so they're gonna fly around and probably get all the gear. So chances are we're gonna get nothing and die, but at least we can say we tried. So, <laughs> and in that you'll see how it works. The more people hear, the more chests will fall. Luckily, um, my goal is always is to get at least one. And here we go. So here we're off. We need to run. Uh, there's a chest there, so punch. And there's two over here. So if we just go slash PV one. Let's put everything in there now. So we punch, punch. Slash PV1. Put everything that you get from these in your um, PVs as soon as you can. Because as soon as someone punches you, you will die. Oh, that's all good. Oh, no, I've been tagged. Oh, that's it. I've lost everything. <laughs> so <laughs> that's all this stuff will be going. Because um, I ran out of space in my other one. And this person's probably going to chase me. And I'm going to die. So <laughs> unless I can get out of combat tag which hopefully will be soon. Unfortunately, I always lag when I come over here. Okay, so PV2. Let's quickly get this stuff in. Okay, so we're lucky. We got quite a lot of chests. That's the most chests I've ever got. My heart always beats really fast. When I do this, I have a lot of adrenaline rush, uh, which is kind of annoying. This helmet's not that great. Hi, he's going to kill me. But I have nothing. <laughs> um... So, yeah. Oh, they're in someone's derp, so you can't take anything. So, yeah. So, that's pretty much it. Uh, it was quite exciting. So, let's go back home and let's see what we got. And I'm in tag, so I can't. But, that's why I always go with no gear. Because, otherwise, you know, people just come in and kill you all the time. Let's see what this person dropped. Anything? None of that. It's not very interesting. Just to leave Frank. I'll take that. Oh, we can go back home now. So, let's go home. Uh... And I saw we got some pretty good stuff. So let's have a look. Because I kind of briefly looked at the notes that we got. So we got an emerald. We got a speed potion, which isn't so good. A unique book. Uh, that's already had. Oh, school voucher for fishing. 
Oh, skill buff. Ouch. Oh, that's really good. Uh, let's go. What else do we have? PV2. Tactical TNT. Uh, those. Uh, was it those ones? I can't remember. Um, PV3. We also got this bow. 500 XP. And this. So we got some pretty good stuff overall. I would say we did actually really well. Usually I only get two chests. So I'm... Um, I'm okay with this. Uh, these skill vouchers are really good. Acrobats 30 plus levels on what I already currently have. And tactical TNT. That's not too good. That's kind of bad. But this is all the TNT that I have. Uh, did we get this chest plate? Oh no, I already had that one. So this is sort of like my good gear over here. Um, it's not that great, but it's okay. So I got normal TNT. Uh, Mimic TP, which is what says there, repeats explosions. I have Hex TNT. Um, and I have the lethal TNT. So, oh, do, what do I want to do with these? Do I want to use them? Or do I want to sell them? I th think it's 10k per 10. So it's like 1k a level? I'm not actually sure. I think it's, yeah, 10, 10k for 10. So it's 1k per level. Or do I just want to use them? Because I don't have anything on fishing. So if I go stats... My acrobatics is 220, so if I use that, that would bring up to 250, which really would take a long time. And fishing, I have absolutely nothing. So, you know what? I think I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna use them because it's only 10k and 30k. Really, that's not a lot of money. Uh, let's see the H. I know it's gonna be crazy, probably. Um, no, it's not too bad. So now we're going to just go sell hand on that emerald. And now let's use the books. Right. Bring in all the fields. Come on. I'm, I'm waiting for the fields. You brought the fields? Okay, the fields are there. Right, let's go. Ugh, you didn't give it. Okay. You guys, come on. Show some more fields. You, you're slacking off. You're not showing enough fields. Now put all the fields into this one book. Make sure I'm on the right book. Yes. Okay. And. Okay. You guys really didn't have the fields going, did you? So. <laughs> those are not the best. What to call. Uh, um, <laughs> it could have been better, but you know, I'm not complaining. So, not going into the PV. So now we're just going to use skill voucher number one on fishing levels and boom. There we go. So if I go slash stats, I should have 10 fishing. So now we'll go and use the 30 levels on acrobat. I am on the right ones, right? Yeah. One, two, three, bam. And there we go. If we go into stats, you'll see now. That it says 250 acrobats. So that's really good. So if you don't know what it does. That's giving you a chance of if you jump off something really high to roll. Which is not take any damage. Or um, I think that's it actually. I think it's just a roll. Or just it just doesn't do any damage at all. So yeah. So that's always good. Uh, we got this bow. Which is not the best bow. But it's also not the worst. But we got 500 XP. Which is really good. Look at all the XP that we have. There's so much XP. <laughs> I bought this because it was cheap, and I bought that one because it was really cheap. And these, if you like, <laughs> I always find cheap ways. Oh, we got some booties. And that, and that. So, but not you. Wait, was it you? Oh, I did get that. Oh, wow, I didn't even see that. That's actually really good. Sharp 3, I'm breaking 4, and decapitation 2. So, decapita decapitation is I can cut off someone's head, basically. Um, which is so charming, I know. So let's sell this, and we will also sell that one. And we'll put these in here for now. Because um, I'm pretty sure they're not actually worth anything. So, yeah. So old boys are really good if you can survive. But always remember to PV your stuff. Unfortunately, you probably won't. To, if you don't have a rank, you won't have... Um, a lot of PV, so you need to make sure that you have room in your PVs, as you saw, I sort of, uh, forgot, <laughs> and I honestly usually only get one to two chests, that was really lucky to get that many, I think I got four, four or five, so that's actually really, really good, once I got a chest, um, and I actually got 250k from it, which was awesome, and it was, Definitely, definitely helpful on getting the money <laughs> that I have today. So let's see how much money we have. 
we have 1.5 million dollars. So let's see if, oops, wrong button. Oops, how much were those for? Those were, okay, it's so overpriced is what those were. So let's see if we can sell this Enderman's Spawner, which I don't think so, because at this time of the day, not many people are willing on buying it. So let's go HL sell, and then we'll go, let's go 96k. At this time of day, not many people really spend that kind of money. It's more of a, uh, during the busy times with, uh, when Americans are awake, <laughs> no offense, but this is like my time zone <laughs> difference where not many people are really on. I mean, if I got up early, which let's face it, that's not going to happen unless I have to, um, you know, so yeah, so that is all, so the Envoy is that, hopefully you enjoyed, if you want to come on and join, uh, just go on the IP and have some fun, it is really fun, I'll show you the lobby, so this is the lobby that they have, it is all space themed, uh, down here you have the outside of the space, and you can fall down into this little like media island thing I'm not quite sure what it's supposed to be it's like yeah but if you go into the star this cosmic star here and then you just go into jungle planet which is the one I'm on and I believe that's Preston's and that is Mr. Waffles Waffles? not Waffles man I'm hungry um planet there there's also all these other ones that have uh, quite a lot of people on it but obviously these ones will have the most so you just click onto jungle and it'll bring you to spawn, not my place. But yeah, so that is... That's falling out of the world. So that is it for this episode. Hopefully you all enjoyed. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you are new. If you want to see more of this, leave a like, um, show support, and I will try to do more videos. The more support, the more videos you get. So I'd like to thank you for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye!